Welcome to business and we'll begin with agriculture. The Nigeria Incentive-Based Risk Sharing System for Agricultural Lending has introduced structured mechanized farming approach to 851 farmers in Ogun State in order to boost business in the state. The Executive Director Technical Nasser Babajide Arowo Shafe made this known during the Anchor Borrowers Program Input Distribution Flag of in Abeokuta. TVC News Kazim Olowe reports. In a shift from the subsistence farming practiced by many farmers in Ewekuru, Yewa North, and Ogun Waterside local government areas of Ogun State, the Nigeria Incentive Based Risk Sharing System for Agricultural Lending, NISA, has organized some maize, rice, and cassava farmers into financeable cooperatives for participation in the 2019 wet season farming under the Anchor Borrowers Program. You can see how massive this operation is. It's actually putting the entire community to work. So that means it's creating job, and NISA is actually driving job creation do, uh, using this farm operation or this production operation. So uh, we're definitely that this is going to contribute to the GDP of Nigeria. Uh, from the farmer hand, uh, government has supported them with this operation. NISA has supported 851 farmers comprising of 581 based farmers. 135 rice farmers and 135 cassava farmers under the Anchor Borrowers Program. The Anchor Borrowers Program will, will increase domestic food production and at the same time improve the capacity of our processors. Beneficiaries thank the federal government for introducing the project. I thank the federal government and NYSHA that uh, give us opportunity. It will empower people and it will help us to have job and um, food security. The representative We're of the Ogun State Government and the traditional ruler in attendance also expressed appreciation to the federal government for the intervention. We want to thank NISA as well as CBA for the Anchor Brass Program. The Alaye and the community will cooperate with the Ogun State Government for the actualization of the project and its development. During a visit to one of the pilot farms at Awowo in Ewekoro local government, the team expressed satisfaction. This is the cassava cluster, and in this cluster we are targeting to have about 2,000 farmers. But as we are talking to you now, we have close to 200 farmers, and they have put in together about 200 hectares, and that is what we are supporting. I want to appreciate the federal government for supporting our farmers, because they have put much more, more effort to make this thing to realization. The federal government says with this opportunity, there will be surplus of food in the country. There will be limited uh, reduction in numbers of importation of food commodities. And of course, there will be provision of jobs for many Nigerian youths and unemployed Nigerians. Kazim Olowe, TVC News, Abel Kutaogon State.